All right, so I got my makeup done, and I'm a little frustrated because this little guy does not want to stop crying. Um, so my, my makeup looks terrible on camera right now. So my house is a complete disaster, so do not mind that today, as I said earlier, I think. Um, but I'm going to be picking up things here and there. But my main goal is, obviously, to just get through this day. Um, three kids by myself. Um, especially when this one doesn't want to sleep. Um, while he was sleeping, and then Ariella will come up, like I said. And all he wants to do is nurse and it's really hard because then i can't get anything else done if i'm just sitting down nursing while he's awake the whole time so he's breaking out a lot too right now um he's breaking out and i've got this giant pimple right here um but anyway so my main goal is to just get these kids through the day look at how dirty my nightstand is from all the late nights it's okay it's okay and um yeah that's basically it so i mean just get through the day i have a lot of things i need to do like editing and um a lot of other things that i need to get done but my main goal is to just survive this day so that's what we're gonna do today i'm taking you along so let's get through it In case you're wondering, this is what the girls are doing. Ariella's laying on Jocelyn's floor. And Jocelyn's in her bed. And they're both watching YouTube. Ariella's going to take a nap in about 15 minutes. So I'm just letting this happen. Um, we do have some activities that if I can get done later, we'll be doing. So this is the status of my kitchen. It's a mess. The recycling needs to be taken out, but the recycling is full, and today's garbage day, so I'm waiting for the garbage man to come pick that up so I can take all this out. Um, dishes need to be done. This is my life, you guys. It's a mess right now. It's a mess. A mess. Don't guarantee that I'll be able to get it all done, but we'll try. So I finally got him calm. He's not sleeping. He's just laying here. Uh, sucking on his binky looking around but um since he's calm i'm just gonna sit here with him for a few minutes until it's time for ariela's nap and then i'm gonna go put her down and i'm gonna hope that he'll go down um because i do like i said i have a video to edit and i want to get those activities printed out i created a few pumpkin um activities that are for sale on my tpt store if i haven't shared that with you guys i've been meaning to i just was pregnant and dealing with a lot of things and um so i have a whole teacher pay teacher store and i'll link that down below i came out with a preschool learning pack um which i'll share with you guys today as well I shared it on my Instagram once. If you don't follow me on Instagram, you're really missing a lot of stuff that goes on because it's easier to share on Instagram than it is on YouTube. Um, but I have a lot of products on there if you want to go and check out the store. It, they're what they are. If you've never heard of Teacher Pay Teachers, it is a website where you can find like um, educational printables, educational stuff like from actual teachers and you can find lesson plans. You can find all kinds of stuff. There's a lot of free stuff on there too. I have my um, unit study planner on there for free, um, but I just came out with a pumpkin pack you can either buy them separately or you can buy them as a bundle which is cheaper to buy them as a bundle um but it's some pumpkin math cards pumpkin um matching pumpkin number matching and then a cute little just fun um pumpkin face building activity what say hi where'd you go you're not in the frame anymore say hi <laughs> 
So I'll leave that link down below in case you want to check that out. The preschool pack is what I use for Ariella, and I'll kind of share that in a little bit um, once I get some free hands. Um, it's a binder. Everything's printable. I laminate everything, and I'll show you guys how I do that when I do the pumpkin pack. Um, so yeah, my hair is a mess, and it's driving me crazy, but you guys, I just don't even have the hands to do anything about it. I've got a newborn, a toddler, and a second grader who needs to be doing school, and I can't even get to that right now. So, um, like I said, though, I'm going to let them just do what they want because it's already almost Ariella's nap time. Um, so I'm going to let them just have screen time, or she can just sit out here, whatever she wants to do, until it's nap time, and then I'm going to put her down for a nap and try to get things done. So I'm going to put down the camera for a little bit and see if I can get this guy to sleep. He looks like he might be ready to go to sleep. Um, so, yep. Okay, so he is sleeping it looks like, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, clear my memory card really quick and then I'm gonna go into the office and get everything set up to try and get um, this pumpkin stuff um, printed out and I'll show you how um, I plan on using it. which I'll link this laminator down below. Um, I really like this laminator, so I'll go ahead and link it in my Amazon store. So this is my preschool um, learning pack that I put together. I just have it in a binder that I picked up from Dollar Tree. This is the shape matching, and this is what I'm talking about Velcro. So just like this, you would put the Velcro piece on here. They come as a set. Um, obviously Velcro comes as the two pieces, the soft piece and the, the rough piece and the soft piece. And then the kids just stick them together like that. That simple. So that's what I plan on doing with the cards for Ariella for now. And then once she's over number recognition, um, they can use them as a memory game. Um, so that'll be a cool little thing. So this is my pumpkin pack. It has three activities and it's on sale for $3 if you buy the whole pack. You can buy these separately. You can buy the math cards separately. You can buy the number matching separately. And then you can buy the pumpkin face building activity separately. But this is $1.25. This is $1.25. And this is a um, dollar when you buy them separately. So if you buy them together, you save 50 cents. Um, which I know is not a lot, but when you're only spending three dollars, that's not a lot anyway So that's my pumpkin pack for fall and I know this is not a lot like building this pumpkin face um, Activity it's not a lot, but the reason I feel comfortable with um, Asking a dollar for it is because you're buying the file You're gonna keep this file forever and you can print off as many copies as you want with the with paying only one dollar so um, yeah, that's why I feel comfortable selling this for a dollar is because I know that, um, you're keeping the file forever. So there you go. That's my pumpkin pack. And this is my preschool pack. As I was saying earlier, here's shapes. It comes with the four pages. So these come on a page, exact same page as this. You just cut them out, laminate them, Velcro them. So that's the shape matching. This is my color matching. This is my number matching. I ran out of Velcro, so I just have one through four right now. There's also an alphabet matching, which I haven't printed out yet. There's a tracing skills page. These ones I just have in the dividers, in the page dividers, because um, they're erasable. So that's what I intended these pages to be, is for you to use dry erase markers and be able to wipe these off. And when you laminate them, they don't wipe off as well. So all of the ones that the kids can write on, I just have... Um, 
them in page dividers which you could also do for these as I was saying and you could just put the main page in a page divider and cut all these pieces up and then stick them in the page divider so that way you don't have to have the velcro pieces or the laminator if you don't have a laminator so then it comes with the trace the lines um, trace the letters trace the numbers trace the shapes and like I said there is an alphabet um, an alphabet matching one as well just like the number one uh, if I can get back to it and so this is 24 pages of a learning activities um, I think it's nine learning activities 24 pages um, for 450 so if you'd like to go check that out um, you can find that in my teacher P teacher store and I'll link that down below all right so I was eating when I realized my screen door was swinging open and shut and I got a package and then I went to go get the package and this little girl woke up say hi Ariella hey. so she's awake and then as I went to go get her he woke up and he started crying and so now I'm feeding him it's like it all happens at once and then it's like this morning when I was trying to do my makeup I totally didn't show that um, he was fussy well I showed that part but he was fussy so then I changed him and fed him fed him and then changed him and then it was like when I was changing him then Ariella needed to be changed it's just like one after the other with three kids like there's no break what you doing there Ariella you look a little sleepy are you sleepy girl <laughs> yeah so anyway I'm gonna share my package in just a minute as soon as I'm done feeding him Okay, so I just fed him and he's in the um, swing and Ariella's, I don't know, somewhere else. So, yay! So this is a package I've been waiting for and I'm super excited to share it with you guys. It is... Oh, you want to see what it is? What is it? Come over here so they can see in the camera. See you right here, right here. They can't see you now, you're too short. There you go. All right, what is it? Yeah. Yes. Open that. Open that. Open that. There we go. What is that? So this is what it is, and it is so excited! Hey, 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 hey. Don't oh. pop it by your brother, okay? It is a diaper bag, and I'm so excited. It's like a backpack diaper bag. It's from a company called Kia Babies, and this is the original backpack. I'll link it down below. But I'm super excited because I really needed a diaper bag. I did not buy a diaper bag this time around. And I was like, you know, I'm used to having a toddler. So I kind of forgot how many things you need with a newborn. And so I was like, I'll just use my purse. It's fine because that's what I would throw a diaper and a wipes and wipes in my in my purse on the go when we were leaving the house with Ariella. But with now two kids in diapers and just other things that you need for the kids, like their binkies and things like that. Um, I needed a diaper bag. So I'm super, super excited that Kia Babies sent me this a diaper bag. And I'll show you all the stuff as soon as Ariella stops pulling on it. Thank you. Let's look at it. Yeah. I so it. in the Yeah. So in the front pocket, right here, it looks like you can put bottles in there. It looks insulated, so it's got like that silver yeah, stuff, and there's okay. room. Hey. There's room for three of them, which is really nice because like if I'm somewhere and I need to pump, like that will keep my milk warm. So that's really cool or cool. And you could put like an ice pack in here and keep that cool. So that's really awesome, especially if you do like formula and um, you could put like an ice pack in here and keep the bottles cool for a while. Oh my gosh, how cool is that? I absolutely love this. And then right here, there's a pocket. This looks like a little pocket to put stuff in. Um, and then it has this strap on here, so you could strap it to your uh, stroller, which is really cool. And here's the main pocket. Let's see what this looks like. 
Oh, I love that it opens like that. You guys. And it has like metal bars in here. So the way it opens is really, really cool. So that it'll actually stay open and won't like fold in on you. Because that's one of the things I hate that my purse does. Is when you're looking for something, you need the bag to stay open. And it doesn't want to. And inside, there's a changing pad. How cool. That matches the diaper bag. It's like that. This and this is such a great size. This is like a large bag too. But when you put it on, it doesn't look so large. But it like this bag could literally go on forever. Oh my gosh. Look at that. My hand disappears. How cool is that? I cannot wait to put all of my stuff in this and actually get to use this. Look how cute that is. Oh my gosh. I love it. And it's like the perfect thing, especially for like winter when you need to carry like extra blankets and extra clothes and an extra sweater for all the kids and stuff. Absolutely perfect. Thank you so much Kia Babies for sending me this backpack. I'm super excited and I'll leave the link down below in case you want to check it out too. Oh my gosh, there's a cool pocket on the side here. How cool. Oh, it's a white pocket. So there's a little slit right here, so you can put a pack of wipes in and pull them out right there. You want chocolate milk? Okay, I'll get you chocolate milk. So anyway, thank you Kia Babies for sending me this backpack. I'm super excited. make a happy face. So these are the um, build a face pumpkin activities or pumpkin building. What I did I count? I can't remember what I called it. Face pumpkin face building activity. Um, so I cut out all the pieces for the girls just now and they're just building little faces. Oh, happy little pumpkin. That's cute. So Oh, no, he's sad. Yeah. Let's make him happy. I don't know. I don't know any more uh, emotion. Um, so I was thinking, if you don't have, hold on, if you don't have a laminator, you could just print this out, and you know your kids could cut these out and glue them on. It would just be a one-time thing. But I did this. I laminated them um, so that the kids can play with them over and over again, and then we could save these every year, and they can have a pumpkin face building activity. So you can buy this in my Teacher Pay Teacher store for $1 or you can buy the bundle for $3 that has my other two pumpkin activities included. Yeah, so um, the ones that I showed you earlier. So this is them playing with the face building activity. You guys like it? Yeah. Is it fun? Yeah. Good. Yeah, I did it. Good job. So Jocelyn is using the build a math cards, um, the pumpkin math cards, which is build a problem. So right now, what are you doing? You're doing one plus four minus one? Yeah, and then just four. Get it? Yep. So all of the um, cards go up to Nine. So the problem cards can go up to nine because I only made the answer cards up to 18. So there's addition and subtraction and equal signs. And there's in total, there's four of these. Hold on. In total, there's four of these rows. Um, and then you have your uh, problems, your problem cards um, that go up to nine. So you can do nine plus and all the way up to nine plus nine. Um, like I said, and then that'll go up to 18. So you have all the way up from 1 to 18 to work. And Ariella is working on matching her numbers. So we just cut up the um, other page that has the dashed lines, and she's just going to place them on there. I don't have Velcro stickies right now, so I can't put Velcro pieces on there. That's two. Where's the other two? That's a two. Do you see the two? 
Two. Yes. Good job. So that's how that works. And that's how the math problem works. And the kids really love the face building. So you can get all three of these activities. Hold on. You can get all three of these activities for $3 on my teacher paid teacher store. Yep. That's a one. Good job. All right, you guys. He is still sleeping in the swing, which I'm really surprised about. Um, so he's been taking a good long nap, which of course, while he's napping, my computer decided it needed to um, update. So I haven't been able to do any work while he's sleeping because my computer needs to update. So um, I, it's about like 2.45. Um, I am going to go lay down for a little bit. So I'm just going to go ahead and end today's video here. I'm sorry it wasn't a full day in the life, but it's really hard with three kids and trying to vlog all day as well. Um, so we got all of our pumpkin activities done and the kids are now um, having some more screen time. Um, that's probably going to be a pretty common occurrence around here lately uh, for a while while I'm getting back into the groove of my, you know, like I'm getting into a new groove or new routine with having three kids. Um, anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, so I'm going to leave the link for the diaper bag down below. I'm going to leave the link for um, my teacher pay teacher store down below. I'm going to leave the link for these slippers down below you guys i got these on amazon and they are the softest comfiest things ever i bought these for the hospital and i was planning on doing my hospital bag video um but i never got around to it because i went into labor um early and they come in like pink which is super cute pink black brown um, I got the gray ones, but I'll leave the link down for these as well so you can order these. And you definitely need them because they are so comfy. Guys. So that is it. There's my little baby sleeping. The girls are in Jocelyn's room watching on the phone and the computer. And um, I'm going to try to survive the rest of this day. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, subscribe if you're new and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.